Hello everybody, welcome to the University of Akron College of Business virtual tour. My name is Kyle Jansen and today we're going to be touring the College of Business. Let's head on inside. All right, when we first come into the College of Business, we walk into the Anthony J. Alexander Professional Development Center. To our left right here, we have the Professional Development Office Suite. This is where we have our internship liaisons, our professional development coordinators, and our Institute of Leadership Advancement. So any help you may need on campus with like student orgs or getting an internship or something like that, these are great resources to use. So let's head up upstairs. Oh, and there's my good friend Ari who can take us through the rest of the tour. Hi guys, my name's Ari Turner and I'm going to show you the second floor of the Professional Development Center. So over here, we have a conference room where we hold different events and you can also reserve it if you want to have study time or meet with a team. It's just a great way to go through some classwork and have a new space. And into this room here, this is our Goodyear uh, classroom. You'll have various classes as well as different events that student organizations will host um, and speakers will come in and talk to us as well. When you come out of the classroom at the end of this little hallway, we have a lot of other events that we'll host over here too. Um, different public speakers will come in and talk about business topics that are relevant. Uh, we'll also have different professional development events to help you better prepare yourself for your career. Uh, you can also come in here uh, in between classes and really just be able to study, have some time to yourself and meet with other people. It's just a great space to use. So on our way down and out of the second floor, you will notice that there is a very beautiful piece of artwork here from a local artist. Uh, we commissioned it. Um, it's just a great, vibrant piece that really represents kind of what we do here in the Professional Development Center. And now we're back on the first floor of the Professional Development Center. Over here, we have some practice presentation rooms. So you can just get ready and prepared, record, get some more feedback from any presentations for classes or organizations that you need to do. On to the side here, we have our business analytics classroom, one of a couple. Um, if you come in, there is uh, plenty of technology, computers, uh, TVs, to get a good view of what's going on in the classroom, what the pr uh, teacher is presenting to you, um, and just really utilize the technology and software and space that you'll be using in real life. As we keep going through the first level, over here we have another classroom. Uh, you'll have different lectures in here. A lot of the Institute for Leadership Advancement does have speakers come in and talk to us. As we walk through, this is just a great common space to talk to everyone, meet up with your friends. And we'll have a couple different offices on the side for more uh, resources for everyone. And on the side, we'll have another business analy analytics classroom. And here, the, are, they are set up more um, so that everyone can be more collaborative with each other. You'll have teams and just really get comfortable with the technology and working amongst one another. And over here on the other side of the hallway, we have another common area where my friend Logan is. Hi. Hi, everyone. My name is Logan. So welcome to the Technology Commons. So in here, we have um, great resources for students to um, be able to rent a laptop. And we have even some print services with the Zip Station. Over here, we also have some really nice, comfortable seating and as well as some computers here to use during your studying. Now, if you want to follow me this way through the rest of the professional development wing. So this way, we're going to the last part of the professional development center. It's the student organization suite. So down this hallway, we have really great resources for our student organizations with offices for storage, conference rooms, and even some refrigerators so that you can um, enjoy some food on campus as well. Um, down this hallway, there's also some restrooms and some other resources as well. Now we're going to go see um, some classrooms. 
Hi, everyone. Um, we're going to go into CBA 121, so come on in. This is one of the typical classrooms here in the College of Business, um, really decent size. This is for one of our more larger classes you would take with your College of Business core requirements, um, which assist with taking a different um, couple different areas within the college to learn more about different majors and classes. Therefore, it makes it really easy for your freshman and sophomore year to just major in anything and then switch over later on with more flexibility. We also have an average class size. This is one of our larger classrooms with about 50 or so students. Um, we also have smaller class sizes the more you, long you go throughout your career. It's also really easy to talk to professors um, and after class time and even during office hours to learn more about the topic and also interact with your fellow students pretty easily with one of these classroom settings. We're going to go head over to the CBA concourse right now just to show you some of the general areas. If you follow me over here to the concourse, it is down this really long hallway that leads to the Buckingham building. So here in the CBA concourse, we have a variety of picnic tables where you can sit and study with your friends. Um, usually pretty packed in here and also there's bulletin boards for each of the student organizations. So you can learn more about different student organizations and how to get involved. We're going to go over here to the atrium again throughout this area here. Here in the atrium, we have different flags to represent the different international students that attend the university of our College of Business here. And um, each flag represents those and are changed interchangeably. We're here on the second floor of the College of Business, and on this floor and the floors above are the different uh, departments where you'll find each of your professor's offices and the dean suite up on the fourth floor. If you follow me this way, we'll also go over to the advising offices. So here we have the um, College of Business advising offices where you can meet with our different academic advisors and also schedule classes and meet with your advisor periodically to check in on things. Hey, Evan. Evan's going to show us Polsky Building. Hey, everyone. My name is Evan Wasson. I'm a sales and marketing management major here at the University of Akron. We're on the third floor here at Polsky, just showing off some of the unique features that we have here. We have Aziz, which is like a convenience store where students can come and get snacks in between classes. We have a Starbucks, a Chick-fil-A, and the home of the UA bookstore where you can come in and get your uh, books, UA gear, and just interact with different students here on this floor. Hey everyone, we're on the fifth floor here at Polsky where we have the Suarez Research Lab, the Taylor Institute of Direct Marketing, and the Fisher Sales Institute, home of professional selling. And that's where we're gonna go first, so follow me this way. So we're in the Fisher Institute of Professional Selling where they have a multitude of things here to help different business majors to sort of future their career and learn a lot while they're at college. So while we're in the Fisher Institute, they have these different rooms in here where you can practice your selling as well as practice, you know, if you have an interview coming up and really get that real world experience. And they have cameras and different businesses that they bring in to help you along the way. So as we continue further along in the classroom, what I'm gonna point out here in the Fisher Institute, we have over 30 different businesses that help you find internships as well as job. And the head of the Fisher Institute, Dave Payne, does a really good job of helping different students find placements at these jobs. Now as we go into the overview in the big classroom itself, we have the giant TVs as well as a giant spacious classroom to really show you know, the different capabilities that the university has to offer. You know, it's super important that we're putting all this money in and that the students are getting a great benefit and outcome of the time when they're at UA. And if you look over here, it's the offices of your professors. So if you need to go and have a chat with them, you know, they're right there and disposable to the students. You know, it's definitely a great time here at UA and the Fisher Institute is a great home. Now we're gonna head over to the Taylor uh, Institute of Direct Marketing.
Hey everyone, now we're going to go over to the Taylor Institute of Direct Marketing here at the University of Akron. Follow along. As soon as you walk into the Taylor Institute, if you look on the wall here, we have some photos of previous University of Akron alumni talking about some of the job placements that they had uh, right after they graduated from the university. As we continue down the hall here, we're going to show a little bit of what the Taylor Institute has to offer for the students here. You know, this is one of the classrooms that we have here. And on the left side here, we have our different innovation rooms where students can come and study and work with their teams when they're doing different group projects. It's really helpful and a great asset to have as a student here at UA. As we continue around the corner here in the Taylor Institute, we're going to show off one of our bigger classrooms here, which is mainly used for gen eds for students at the University of Akron. It's a great atmosphere to be in because it really allows you to work together in those teams and build together in these collaborative environments, which helps you build real world experience when you're ready to graduate and be able to work together with the team. And if you look past farther here after the classroom on the left and farther back, it's the offices of some of the professors here at UA, which is really helpful if you have any questions or you get done with the class and you need to go and chat with them. It's super beneficial to have. Keep following along this way. Hey everyone, as we continue around here at our tour of the Taylor Institute of Direct Marketing, we're gonna take a look down this hall and tell you a little bit more about the features that we have here in the institution. Down the hall, we have different marketing labs with computer classrooms that, you know, the students get to have these different experiences and get to use different softwares that they maybe have not been able to use before. And these are things that certain people, when they're going to apply for a job, that these companies are looking for those skills that you have. Also, we have a creative studio back here which students get to use when they're doing their capstone class at the end of the year with a giant presentation for a client, as well as getting to put their skills to the test and really showing you know, everything that they've learned so far throughout all the different institutions of the College of Business. Hey everyone, we're at the Suarez Research Lab right here. And this is one of the cool, unique features that we have here on the fifth floor of Polsky. It's where students are able to come in in their classrooms and use this software technology of the eye tracking center in the research lab and really get to put their skills to the test and learn about real world things when it comes to marketing. Thank you for joining us today on our virtual tour. We hope to see you in the fall. Go Zips!